has finally sprung here in Southern Ontario. It's so nice not to have to wear our winter coats and our boots and our hats and our mitts. We can be like most other geovloggers out there now and be nice and warm and comfortable. And we're after one cache today and we just want to bring you along for a walk in the woods. A beautiful day it's going to be. Let's go find the cache, but not just any cache. Let's see what, what it is when we get there. Cash found. Right. There we go. Cash found. A little bit off the coordinates we had, but not too bad. A nice ammo can. One of the oldies. Yeah, let's see what's in here. Oh. Look at that. Oh, a nice easy container to get into. It's a giant nano. A button. That was in the cash. Kind of suitable for Cash Canada. Canada, eh? This cache hasn't been found since a year ago, January. Except for the CO, nobody's been here since January of 17. So this is a long lost cache. We'll get our names in there. We wanted to come and get this one. Down by the old Mill Creek. Hidden in April of 2001 and unbelievably close to home. We're about 30 kilometers from home and we haven't got this one yet. It's been on my map, on our to-do list. It was list. a bit of a climb though. A bit of a climb. Yeah. We had to kind of figure out how to get in here. I couldn't quite figure out. I was always on the wrong side. I've been here a couple of times and looked and I thought, no, I'll wait for good weather. So here we go. We got an oldie. A lot of people around here have already got this one. It's the first one for us, but hey, awesome. It's a good cache. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Maybe. Hey, let's go hide a cache. There, it's nice to finally get that one. I looked at it a few weeks ago, but then we still had snow at that point, and it looked like it would probably be not very fun walking in these woods at that time. You did miss all the rose bushes. <laughs> We think we found a, a cool spot to hide this one and it was uh, almost 17 years ago that the Mill Creek cache was hidden on the 28th of April 2001. So almost 17 years later we're going to put a cache right here. We have permission from the Conservation Authority and uh, we're going to call it 17 years later. Hey thanks for watching. Come back again and uh, well you can subscribe by pushing the button and if you like, please like it. And uh, don't forget to uh, Cache Canada. Or Saskatchewan. Or North Dakota. It's right next to Saskatchewan. <laughs> Where will geocaching take you? See you later. See ya.